what's going on youtube jeans here hope you guys are having an amazing day today we are back yet again bringing you guys some more competitive ranked double battles for pokemon scarlet and pokemon violet in today's video we're going to be showcasing a lot of people's favorite regional bird star raptor you guys already know the deal if you do enjoy the content anytime make sure you support me as a content creator by leaving a like on today's video and if you're not subscribed to the channel click that big red subscribe button so you know when all of my videos go live but like i said we're using star raptor today and a lot of people seem to absolutely love this pokemon including myself it's just such a cool pokemon and all around absolutely amazing and it's pretty solid on the rank ladder so cannot wait to use it with a lot of these meta pokemon that we have in front of us and grab some wins with it but we can get started here in the top left corner with Star Raptor for today's team preview. Rocking the Reckless ability, which gives a 20% increase to moves that have recoil damage. So such as Brave Bird, Double Edge, those are going to get a 20% increase in damage with this ability, making this thing hit like an absolute truck. It has a Cover Cloak as its item. Then moveset is Tailwind for Speed Control, Brave Bird, Close Combat, and Double Edge for its three heavy hitting moves. Second Pokemon is going to be Raichu with the Lightning Rod ability. And Lightning Rod is going to help protect our Star Raptor and our Palafin within the battle up against Electric Pokemon. Raichu also has to focus as an item. And then the moves it's rocking is Fake Out, Thunderbolt, Nuzzle, and Terrorist. Third Pokemon on today's team is going to be Arcanine. Not just any Arcanine. We got Mirror Herb Intimidate Arcanine. And I was kind of like confused to how this would work. But you can actually intimidate the fine Pokemon and then Mirror Herb them at the same time. So that could be really, really good for, for you if you know you can outspeed that Pokemon. Because that will give you a plus one on the attack stat that you kind of roll out from there and get after the battle. Arcanine has Protect, Will-O-Wisp, Extreme Speed, and Flare Blitz for its four moves. Fourth Pokemon is going to be Annihilate, and Annihilate has just been taken over the meta. One of the best ranked Pokemon at the moment with the Fine and the Lumberry as its item and ability. Then moveset is pretty normal with Protect, Drain Punch, Rage Fist, and Final Gambit. Bottom left hand corner is going to be Meowskarada. I've been using a lot of Protein and Choice Band Meowskaradas as recently, and it just hits like an absolute truck and is really good on any single team. This one has Sucker Punch, Knock Off, Flower Trick, and Player Off. Typically, I like to run the U turn on Meowskarada with the Choice Band, but Player Off works just as well. Final Pokemon is going to be my favorite Gen 9 Pokemon. It is going to be Palafin. This little dolphin over here has taken my heart and I fell in love with this thing. <laughs> it has Zero to Hero as its ability, the Life Orb as item, then it's Rock and Flip Turn, Haze, Jet Punch, and Wave Crash. So really good physical attacker and then on top of that it can counter down Dozo teams or any Pokemon trying to set up with that Haze ability. Or not Haze ability, Haze move. Guys, if you want to run this team for yourself, run the code is at the top right hand corner, but let's get after it. Let's hop on that ranked double ladder, look to grab some wins with this Star Raptor team. First match coming at you guys, going up against an Indeedee and Armourouge combo team. I've been seeing Indeedee and Armourouge all over the ladder, and it's rightfully so, considering it is so strong. This team also has Murkrow, Golden Go, Water, Tauros, and then Meowskarada. How should I lead this one? How should I go into it? My Meowskarada itself is going to be very, very strong here, but I do feel like the Indeedee and Armourouge combo is going to come here, right? I feel like it's got to come out and about. How should we play this one? Who should I go into? Um, so Raptor's not bad lead here. Especially if he ends up going Murkrow, we can just set up the, uh, the Tailwind ourselves and kind of roll off from there. So I am kind of liking that. I am definitely kind of liking that. I also really like Miascarada, so I am going to end up leading Miascarada. If I can't go into Sucker Punches, that's totally fine. I have Knock Off to do some damage onto the Armourouge and onto that Indeedee slot. So I'm going to go Miascarada for a lead. I may also go in with a Raptor. Do I go Raptor or do I go in with a Pokemon more so like Palafin? Try to flip turn out of there and then get Raptor in there? That wouldn't be bad. Or I could just straight up haze. If he's going into like the stored power shots, all that good stuff. Yeah, you know, I'm going to go Palafin. I'm going to go Palafin here. Bring in Star Raptor in the back end. And then last but not least, I feel like my boy Rage Fist can just get some work done, right? Do I go Annihilate or do I go Arcanine? Hmm. What is the play? I feel like... I feel like my Rage Fist boy can actually get some work done. Actually, no. We're going to go Arcanine. We're going to go Arky. I like Intimidate on this thing. And I like the E-Speed. Plus, it's super effective on the Golden Go. I like it all around. I like it all around. So, hopefully we grab ourselves a win here in match number one and get more and strong with the Star Raptor team. But if you guys are not followed to my social medias already, make sure you guys head down to the link in the description below. I believe our Instagram and our Twitter pages linked down there. We're going to start utilizing them a lot more. I have old content on my Instagram. I'm going to revamp it, use it up a little bit more, making a TikTok for Gene's channel. I'm going to be bringing you guys tons of content. Plus, like I said, I'm bringing you guys members. Members is almost done. We're bringing an exclusive Discord page for members and members only. So... That's going to be hype. It's definitely going to be hype. We're going to have a lot of stuff in there. But like I said, I just want to utilize all my social medias a little bit more and try to grow the channel a bit more. So, hopefully you guys are interested. But Golden Go and Armourouge come out here for the lead. I really don't mind that. Considering I could straight up suck. I could, but I feel like a swap could be in here, right? I feel like you could definitely swap 
So I'm just gonna go for a nice lovely flip turn and into a knockoff here. Yep, he withdraws the golden go. Perfect turn for us. We're not going for any first turn priority moves. And he's gonna swap straight into the Indeed. So Indeed he comes out here, he should have led the Indeed. I'm totally fine with this. I am totally fine with this. Unless Armourouge protects. Armourouge does not protect. Knockoff coming out here. We're switching to straight dark and that should be bye bye Armourouge, right? Later Armourouge. We get rid of that Pokemon and I'm super surprised he didn't just straight up lead that Indeed. I'm really surprised. I'm really super surprised at that. But now we flip turn out. And wow, that damage was huge. Critical hit with Palpins. Flip turn. Rocky Helm is going to deal damage. But now we are in our hero form. And we're ready to rock. But now I bring out Star Raptor too. I get out the lovely Raptor. Lovely little bird. And I love the noise it makes when it hops into battle. Oh my god, dude. It's gorgeous. Let's hear it. Let's hear it. Star Raptor coming in hot here. We have Indeedee already down to killable HP. I can take it out with Raptor. Um, I could go... Hmm. What do I want to do here? I think I have to knock off this Golden Go, right? Even if it's Steel Terra's? I could predict the Steel Terra. I could easily predict the Steel Terra. I don't think we need Tailwind up. I feel like a lot of his Pokemon are slow. So wasting a turn with Tailwind isn't really going to do much for us. So I'm just going to stick with the knockoff in the Golden Go slot. Even if it's Steel Terra's, that's totally fine. And I'm just going to go into a straight break here. Just finish off in DD. I'm cool with that. Does not Terra later Golden Go. Oh my god. GG's. This match is over with. Not to rationalize and bad lead from our opponent's side. GG. Good game. GG. Good game. Great Bird's flying here. And that's how we get this video started. That is how we get this video started. Absolutely tearing through our opponents. Playing this one pretty solid. And we still, like, we still have very strong Pokemon in the back. And we have Palaf in the hero form, which I can just jet punch. But this next Pokemon isn't surviving any of her shots, right? It's gonna be me asking about it. I'm just gonna Brave Bird that thing. I am choice into a knockoff here. And I'm just gonna rip this thing into a Brave Bird, right? Brave Bird's our best bet. Battle was canceled. It's that easy, ladies and gentlemen. First match went perfectly for us, starting off today's video with a lovely clean sweep. Now we're hopping into our second battle, and like I said, we've been going up against so many Armourouches, and nothing is changing here. We're going up against an Armourouche team with Annihilate, Golden Go, and then Murkrow, Meowskarada, and last but not least, they got the lovely little Mousehold. So if I had to guess the combo that they're going into, or the lead that they're going into, it's going to be Annihilate and Mousehold. Very relevant, everybody's using it at the moment, so... We kind of got to get after it that way. So I feel like Miascarada is not too bad for a lead here. So I'm going to rock out Miascarada. So Miascarada is going to come in here. I kind of want something to counter up onto that uh, mouse hold. And would Star Raptor be the call here? Or would it be more so like Annihilate? I feel like Annihilate could be really good for us. So you know what? I'm going to say screw it and go Annihilate here. I also do have Gambit it with it if we want to use it. But I'm just going to go Annihilate alongside Miascarada and then bring Raptor in the back end. Yeah, I really like Raptor. Or I could lead Raptor. I could definitely lead the Raptor. Hmm. I really like a lead. I really like a lead. So we're going to go in with these Pokemon. And then I am going to bring in final, probably Arcanine, right? Like Arcanine gets a decent amount of value. It's going to be super effective onto that, uh, onto that Golden Go and get some work done onto Annihilate. I know Intimidate will pop Defiant, but we have that Mirror Herb for that instance. So if we pop Defiant, we're just going to uh, boost our stats as well and kind of match their energy and get after the battle that way. But yo, that first battle, too easy. It's too easy. It's like what that LeBron James mean. It's too easy. <laughs> That's exactly what we did there. We just ripped into our opponent. Dropping Brave Birds, hitting them hard with knockoffs, and just getting after the battle that way. But they go into Mouse Hold and Arm. And this is just like a free Sucker Punch, right? Do I Sucker Punch this? The reason I want to Sucker Punch it is because oh, it's tough. Actually, we're still going to do it. We're just going to Sucker Punch it. And I could tear it into Ghost if I want to, but I'm just going to stray stay straight here and we're just gonna roll in here but uh he's gonna end up terrestrializing that's totally fine he terrestrializing here arm moves into what straight psychic straight psychic that's totally fine so that thing's going for attacking move we're gonna be able to sucker punch through it hopefully follow me's not coming out here we're kind of hoping he's just going for like a beat up combo sucker punch is gonna fire we're gonna swap and we're gonna say bye bye to you right <laughs> yo dude we are ripping into these guys <laughs> we are ripping so he wanted to go into the beat up into uh into Arm Rouge, and we're just slaying these teams right now. We're absolutely just ripping our opponents right now. Beat up's gonna go into the Arm Rouge. See you later. Fails, Train Punch coming hot. Bill, 
dealing some crazy damage. I'm choosing the Sucker Punch now. Uh, Rocky Helm's gonna do a little bit of damage. Uh, do we swap our Miyashirata? Might want to do that and maybe pull out Intimidate Arcanine. If they throw out a physical attacker, it's gonna be an island. So he's ready to go again. He is ready to go again. Uh, I say we stay in here. Uh, do we? What do we do here? What do we do here? Because we know he's gonna beat up. And Sucker Punch is just gonna come in clutch, right? It really is. I could throw Asslize into straight grass. I'm gonna sucker punch and I'm just gonna drain the punch again. We're just gonna keep the punches rolling. Follow me comes out here. That's totally fine. So he's probably gonna drain punch, take out my Miascarata, but from here we take out his mouse hold and we have some other Pokemon that we can get after with. The sucker punch is gonna fail here. He's gonna go for drain punch. Yep. So he say see you later, my Miascarata. And that's why I was gonna swap. Or I was even gonna throw Asslize too. That's totally fine. That's totally fine. We took out two of his Pokemon. And he took out only one of mine. I kind of like where we're sitting here. We still have Intimidate Arcanine, which i not sure if I want to bring out just yet. Not sure if I want to bring out just yet. I feel like what's called could be really good here. Star Raptor. Because we know Star Raptor outspeeds Annihilate. As long as it's not Bandit. Or not Bandit. As long as it's not Scarf. So I feel like going into a Pokemon like Star Raptor is going to be solid for us. Plus, we can Terra into Straight Flying type just so these fighting moves can be weak to us. Miyashirata is going to pop out here. So Miyashirata comes out here. Uh, I could set up a Tailwind if I want to. I feel like just Brave Bird and something, right? I feel like just Brave Bird dropping you, correct? Makes the most sense. I'm going to do that. And you know what? I could Gambit, but they're going to outspeed me, rip into me. I think I'm just going to protect here. I think just protect and Annihilate. Mm, protect your Annihilate. Or is that my Annihilate? Which Annihilate is that? It's both. Yeah. Okay, so we both protect. Hopefully, we're both going after Annihilate. That would be the best play. And that's exactly what's happened. So we're going to see Protect. We're going to see Protect. And we both still have Terror, too. We both still have Terror. And at this point, I still got a Brave Bird, right? You know, I'm going to say screw it. And if you're going for a fairy move, I'm going to swap my uh, the Intimidate here. I'm thinking of just swapping this thing, protecting it, and setting up a Tailwind maybe next turn. That's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to swap my Annihilate. We have the upper hand so far. This is a great battle. This is a good battle. And we're going to swap it to our Arcanine. First of all, we get off that Intimidate. We know we're going to Defiant Pop. We already know we're going to Defiant Pop. That's fine because we're going to Mirror Herb that. And now both of us are going to be plus one. And more importantly, Miyashkabaya drops a minus one. That's huge. The mirror popping out here. My Arcanine is now plus one as well. And I can't believe they haven't fixed this dang camera angle yet. Like, what is going on here? Knockoff's going to fly through here. I'm able to soak pretty well here. Knocks off my Cover Cloak. Can I get off Brave Bird? I do. And let's just say bye-bye to him. What, Reckless? Later, yo. Star Raptor coming in hot here. Big time plays for us. That's pretty much GG's. Now I have the Annihilate dead. My... Arcanine's plus one. I can straight up just flare blitz and say GG. Plus, I can go into a Brave Bird. But if he changes to Dark, we can cover that slot with that. And if he stays grass, we can just take him out from there. But battle's canceled. 2-0. and oh. It's too easy. Third and final match coming at you guys. Let's grab ourselves a perfect record for today's video. Going up against a Garchomp team with Bax Calibur, Mousehold, and Annihilate combo. And then the Rock and Volcarona and Amoongus. Okay, so they can actually do a lot. I gotta watch out for Flame Body Volcarona. Definitely gonna be a problem with all of our physical attackers. Um, I could go Palafin for a lead. I kind of like Palafin for a lead, but I'm terrified of that Volcarona, right? Volcarona seems like it's going to be a big problem. Might end up leading my Raichu here. I lead the Raichu? I mean, we can fake out Masshold at that point. I think I'm gonna go Raichu into maybe Palafin. I need need to be able to get after a lot of these Pokemon. I'm going to go Palafin here. I'm going to try to flip turn out from Palafin, but oh my god, this seems like a problem. This seems like a problem, that Flame Body. Flame Body seems like a problem here. Okay, so from there, I could actually Lumberry hit it. That's not too bad, but I want to bring Miyashirata for sure. And then last but not least, either Star Raptor or Annihilate. What would be a better Pokemon to bring in here? I mean, we're showcasing Star Raptor, so let's have some fun with this one. If we, if we lose this battle, it's no big deal. I don't really care considering we already grabbed ourselves a winning record. I'm just hoping you guys are enjoying the content. So I'd rather showcase Star Raptor over Annihilate in the third and final battle. 
but we'll see who our opponent wants to lead but this one seems like it's gonna be a tough one the first two battles went perfect for us we were dominating this one seems like it's gonna be tough especially if he brings in volcarona but really cool he did not bring out volcarona we have fake out uh we have to fake out the what's called correct we have to fake out the Garchomp, but I feel like Garchomp's the one to protect, right? It might just double protect. Do I hard swap here? I feel like Garchomp is the one to protect, so I'm going to fake out you, and I'm just going to hard swap. Actually, why would I hard swap? I'm just going to flip turn. It's a free flip turn. It's a free flip turn. Garchomp's going to protect, no problem. It does not. That hurts the soul. That hurts the soul. Do you outspeed, Palfin? You do not, but still. Zombie attention can come out here, and it's going to bring me down to Sash. I can deal with that. That's that's no problem. That's no problem. Okay, I don't I don't mind that. I don't mind that too much. I just could have sworn the guard chop was protecting. I could have sworn it was protecting. But that's totally fine. We we still get off our flip turn. We kind of roll off from there. But uh, hmm. When we go into premiere. We have me Astrovada with play rough. We do have the bird, the brave of the birds. I'm kind of feeling like a a protein play rough is probably the call, right? It makes the most sense. He wouldn't. He would not change typing at this point. Wait, I can go back in the Palafin. Oh no, it won't let me. I was gonna say, why is it giving me the option to swap in? I was gonna say he's definitely coming back in here. But yeah, Miascarada is definitely gonna be a call here. I'm gonna go Miascarada. I am gonna slow down the back caliber with the nuzzle, and I'm just gonna protein switch into a play rough. That's gotta be my play. The nuzzle coming out here, and then just play rough. Play rough switch you. See what our opponent does here. Double dragon. Though. That looks sick though. Garchomp and Bax Cali. Looking tough on the field, right? Looking so sick. I love it. I love it. Bax Cali, baby. Wonder what he is gonna do, because a smart play would be protect the chomp and just attack. But I feel like I don't, I just don't think he thrash slides or anything. There's no way he thrash slides in the ground with me Oscar out on the field. That'd be a bold move. That'd be a really solid move in this instance, but. I just don't see it happening, right? Maybe he's thinking, maybe he's sitting here, is he, is he like, this genius have play rough? But he is going to Tarrasalize. Baxcalibur? It is going to be Baxcalibur. Okay, I'm cool with Baxcalibur. Maybe going to the snow here. Straight electric. Whoa there. Oh there. Electric? That's wild. That's wild. That is wild. Play rough's going to come in here. We're protein switching. Hitting up on this guard chop. We're saying bye-bye. Electric bag is cow. What? What is going on here? This is absurd. This is absurd. This is absurd. That'd be the last typing, I guess. So now we nuzzle, and we don't get the paralyze because he's electric type, and he can glaive rush, and he ch chooses to glaive rush that. Actually, smart because if he would have glaive rushed my Miascarada, I would have been fairy type, and it wouldn't have affected me. Okay, so from here, Pally Pally's coming out here. Pally Pally's coming out here. Pally Pally's coming out here. I still have Terrasalization, which I don't know who I should save it for. This follow me is definitely coming out here. And who's faster? No, that's scary. Do we think this thing's rocking Terra Blast? Who's faster? You're faster. Ah, uh, that kind of hurts. That flip turn here, I feel like we get more value out of Palafin. This sucks because if it has Terra Blast, it's just going to rip into me. I'm going to flip turn. Obviously, I want to go after Baxter Caliber, but if he follows me the shot, that's fine. I'd rather have Palafin over Star Raptor. Wow, this electric Baxter Caliber might be the death of us here. This thing is terrifying. <laughs> Maybe it doesn't follow me. And we can just outspeed and rip into this Pokemon. But yeah, follow me comes out. He plays smart. They played smart. It's all good. That's all good. Playoffs gonna slide over. Oh, dude, if that could have picked up KO, that could be big. Flip turn's gonna come out here. I'm gonna say bye bye to you. And if he's going for electric move, we'll allow it. We just rather him take out my Star Raptor than Palafin. I love both the Pokemon, but Palafin is up there with my favorite Pokemon of all time. Really like this Pokemon. I really like it. Especially when it's just a dolphin. When it's outside of battle, I like it just as a little dolphin. But when it's in battle, you know, I like it as the big boy, big hero form. We're going to Raptor. Glaive Rush is coming out here. We are fairy type. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Dumb play. Dumb play. Dumb, dumb play. Dumb play. 
Oh, baby. We like this. Brave Bird, attack. Play rough, attack. <laughs> Might even protect that. Uh, nope, just cancels battle. Wow, we made three opponents quit today. Three no perfect record. Today was light work. It was just super easy, super simple, three cancel battle Star Raptor perfect record video for you guys. Absolutely dominated with it and got to showcase every single Pokemon. We used the Star Raptor a good bit. We got my boy Palafin out there with the life orb doing a lot of work. Miastro Battle was probably MVP for today's video, ripping into Pokemon. Doing a lot of damage, one shot in pretty much every Pokemon. Then you got the Arcanine and Natalie from Raichu, which all got some loving in today's video. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when all of my videos go live. Seriously, you guys rock out. Make sure you spread some positive day, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace out, everybody.